Now, the Student Athlete of the Month, delivered by Papa John's. Hi, everybody. Each and every month, Channel 13, proud to bring you the Athlete of the Month. And in November, we make a stop at New Powell High School to chat with this young man. I guess it's a... If you spend a quick minute watching the Dragons football team, you'll notice number six because he's everywhere. Brody Luker plays offense and defense. He never leaves the field. It gets really tiring, um, but we have a good rotation system because we got a lot of seniors and a lot of guys who can play. So we, if we get tired, we come out, but most of the time, if we're good to go, we're playing both ways. He's a three-year starter and leads by example. Brody sets the tone for everyone else, and the coach can't say enough nice things about this 17-year-old. They have a lot of respect for him. He was voted a, a team captain. He's tremendous in the classroom with over a 4.0 GPA. And, you know, when you've got a kid like that to look up to and, and a kid like that to respect, I think that just, you know, continues to build upon what his legacy is here, that he does things the right way uh, on the field, which is great, but more importantly, he does the right things off of it, and it just makes an all-around special kid. Let's go! Let's go. Brody likes challenges, and he really enjoys football, but he loves the classroom. Schoolwork is always a priority because, I mean, um, you can get you can get any college with your grades. You can't always do that with your athletics, so it's always good to focus on school. And, um, you know, football might not ever pander out from, for anybody, but school can always get you somewhere, so I always try to focus on school. His focus is paid off. Brody has achieved a 4.1 grade point average. He takes all the tough classes, too and take all the honors classes, AP classes, stuff like that, and just get all the homework done on time. That's the main thing, is just get it done on time. And high school shouldn't be too bad for you. Imagine juggling honors classes with the demand of football. That takes a special talent. It makes it really difficult on, on you know, high school athletes in general, but especially ones that are in the a little bit more of the rigorous sports where the, the hours spent away are, are higher. Uh, I think it makes things a lot more difficult. So to have grades like he has and to be able to excel in the classroom like that is, is really special. But Brody admits he didn't always have that knack for the books. He wants to encourage other younger kids to keep after it. I was always a little, I had a hard time focusing. Um, I still kind of do. I never really thought I was that great of a student, but I mean, if you just try to try your best to focus and get your schoolwork done, then who knows what can happen. What's next for Brody? He's headed for Hanover College, and it sounds like he might try to take my job. I like, I think broadcasting's kind of interesting. I'm looking into that. I've always liked movies, and it'd be a dream to, like, make movies, but everyone, I mean, that's, not many people can ever do that. So, I mean, well, we'll, we'll see what'll happen. So, congratulations to the kid with the hairdo, Brody, our Athlete of the Month. If you know somebody who deserves extra special recognition, go to our website, WTHR.com. I'm Dave Calabro.